hey guys so today i'm gonna be doing a pregnancy update um i know that i haven't done one <laughs> in a while i haven't been on youtube in a while and uh you know pregnancy has been hard and i just like haven't had a lot of time between having twin boys and being pregnant and taking care of the house and etc etc i just haven't had time to uh record and do pregnancy updates as much as i would have liked to but uh i'm doing on uh, doing one now and i'll stop uh babbling and uh trying to explain but uh this update is a 36 week update and if you see me looking down it's because i have like notes here um it's a 36 week update i am uh 36 weeks uh today actually i turned 36 weeks so um the last update i did was on my the end of my first trimester so just kind of i did a recap of that so i won't go into that part but i uh do want to kind of mention how my second trimester was and the beginning of my third trimester um was and i'm sorry if i keep gasping for air but i am a do here pretty soon and I can't breathe <laughs> very good so <sighs> that's why I'm gasping for air <laughs> but anyways I am 36 weeks uh, today like I said and uh, just to go back uh, to my second trimester um, I had uh, done an update on the first trimester and said how uh, I had a hard time with that uh, with eating and uh, there was some uh, throwing up and vomiting and nausea and blah 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 in my first trimester so that wasn't fun um but then uh i got out of my first trimester around when i was um four or five months in my second trimester i things changed uh i started feeling a lot better i had a lot of more energy um the nausea and the eating problems you know went away i was able to eat more uh food and I was able to uh, not uh, not throw up, and I don't I don't uh, get nauseous or throw up anymore. But um, so months four and five were pretty easy, and I, I was even telling some of my friends how I just wanted to enjoy this pregnancy, you know, and just for it to go by slow, you know, because I wanted to enjoy it. And boy, did that feeling go away? <laughs> because now I'm feeling like okay, I'm done, I'm ready uh let's get the baby out uh and the reason is when i uh turned about six months is when things started getting hard again and boy did they get hard um i had a lot you know a lot of the regular uh pregnancy stuff like back pain uh hip pain uh heartburn uh and all those things are normal you know you're pregnant you're gonna get hip pain in the hips and and uh back pain and heartburn and blah 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 but uh the one that really really affected me was uh i started getting sciatic pain so uh the baby uh, according to the doctor uh, the position that the baby is in was uh pushing against my sciatic nerve and that just was a killer uh i couldn't walk very good there was times you know i was walking around like i was a 90 year old it was really bad i couldn't you know get up or walk good i couldn't sleep uh it hurt any position that i was in whether i was standing lying down sitting down whatever you know people would say you know just uh you need to rest which is true but that didn't help um in any position that i was whether i was sitting laying down sleeping or walking whatever it was the sciatic pain was bad uh it's a pain that runs like on on your right side and it goes uh from your like lower back all the way uh down to your leg and it's horrible so that it was the killer uh for me that's and that just started going away now and i am now like eight and a half months and that barely started going away so uh, i've been dealing with that for about two and a half months and it was very bad it was not good 
uh now that i am uh doing a couple of weeks i have been feeling a lot of pressure too uh so that's another symptom symptom that i have now now let me talk a little bit about the baby uh the baby uh is very it's, it's 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 a very good size i went to the doctor my last ultrasound was at 30 weeks five days so 31 weeks sorry 31 weeks and five days and the baby was already weighing five pounds and three ounces which is way uh heavier than it's supposed to be uh the baby was measuring uh two weeks ahead and the doctor was saying how it was going to be a big baby and blah 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 so um i am at high risk because of that because the baby's measuring ahead and it's bigger in size so uh that puts you at risk of preterm labor because of the heaviness of the baby um so yeah and uh i had been planning to do a separate video with uh the gender reveal of the baby we already do know the the gender of the baby and i had um I had all these ideas of how I wanted to kind of reveal the gender of the baby and blah 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 but uh, I haven't had much energy at all so I just figured you know all those ideas that I have um, I just haven't gotten down to filming the video uh, and making a nice announcement so I just thought you know I'm giving you guys an update let's just get it over with and tell you guys the gender so the gender of the baby let me show you the baby is a little boy so as you can see I bought this little sleeper and it says little brother it's just a little sleeper um, so yeah we are having a boy this is our third boy we have twin boys and so this will make a third one and uh, we are just excited uh, to see kind of them grow up and the bond that they're gonna have you know with three brothers i think that'll be like a lot of fun and we're just thankful that the baby's healthy and the baby's good um and yeah we're excited to have a, a little baby once again uh with having twins uh you get to go through the baby stage all at once with both babies and so that was the only one time that we got to have a baby at home and they grew up together and blah 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 even though this is our third child it kind of feels like it's our own, only our second time getting to experience you know having a baby at home so we are definitely excited for that and so yeah we're excited we're having a boy and um let's see i think that's about everything that i have had to say except for um i will say that um uh, I am scheduled for a c-section uh, I will be having a c-section I had a c-section with the boys because you know being twins you know the risk and blah 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 the position that the boys were in I had a c-section and this time around is going it, it is going to be a c-section as well uh, because of some uh, issues also and just a just a higher risk of having a natural birth so i just thought that i would mention that and that is all that i have for this uh, video i hope that you guys enjoyed it and i will be trying to make a couple of more pregnancy updates now that um now that i have some energy back i will try to be making some of those uh i have some other videos coming up that i will be actually filming today as well and um so yeah so uh make sure that you give uh, this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it uh if you're new to my channel make sure that you subscribe you hit the uh, red button in the bottom in the bottom and uh thank you guys for watching bye guys mm -hmm.